This is an incredibly rare Panasonic Pix Titanium. I believe, if memory serves me correct, this is a 1988 model and purchased from the original owner. Like I said, these titaniums were very expensive when they were new and they were custom ordered to the rider as part of the PIX program here in the U.S. This one has the full Shimano, well, I won't say full, but it has a Shimano 600 Altegra tricolor group, which actually looks really good with the titanium. I was debating changing that out to Durace, and I actually just, I don't know, I like the uh, look of the, the calipers look really good next to the titanium and didn't really have any objections and yes it has a really ugly seat post that should go but this car or this car <laughs> this bike has been just hanging in storage for a while and so I figured I'd get it out and take some updated video of this one and it does have a titanium fork as well if you look at the detail here it actually looks very much, and I believe it to be the Sumitomo fork, which some of you that are into titanium will no doubt recognize. Now the frames on these, uh, kind of debatable. I've seen people say that these were actually built by Sumitomo, but given Panasonic's history in bicycle production and their pride in bicycle production, by the way, yes, this is hideous. That's just kind of a temporary thing. <laughs> um, it seems odd to me that they would actually let someone else produce their frames and put their name on it. It seems like Panasonic would definitely want to do that themselves, but the welds are very, very nice, especially for the era. And it does have that great red to bare titanium fade. And of course the rather unique turbo bio saddle, the stripes that seem to look good on this bike. But to show some of the detail get that on the brake bridge there. It's unique that this has some uh, array of, you know, the wheels are kind of custom on this. It's got Araya CT19 in the front and rear, but it does have Campy hubs, which is kind of unique. So clearly a custom built deal. Um, when I purchased this bike from the original owner, he actually used to race this and it had these really really cool zip arrow disc wheels if you remember the red zip arrow discs and it also had some really <laughs> classic greg lemon style uh, arrow bars and i actually have those bars and i think they're did a little research on them once upon a time and they're they're truly dating back to like you know what lemon had used in the tour back in 88 or 89 and pretty unique and so I think I'm gonna actually end up selling those bars off at some point but uh, not sure about this bike yet it's it's one of my favorites but like I said I've been thinning the collection a little bit lately and so we shall see <laughs> so keep an eye on the Panasonic Bike Museum uh, website and also within the Facebook page and group uh, if it does go up for sale then you'll be the first to know but yeah, this one even has the old school Michelin Highlight Comp 700 by 20 C. Bet you haven't seen those in a while. <laughs> those were actually new old stock tires that I had sitting around that I thought I'd put on here to replace the worn originals. But yeah, absolutely gorgeous bike and not something you'll see every day. So I hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you in the next video.